one point ahead on 26. That one second is worth just half a second head start. To Three, two, one. The whistles were straight after each other and the contenders are straight after each other. This reminds me of the competition last year uh, between a paratrooper and a marine where they were neck and neck throughout the eliminator. And look at this. There's not a lot in it. Both pumping those handbikes. Don't forget the men use the handbikes over the traverse pit. Exactly the same rules. If they fall, they have to wait 10 seconds. Now onto the rolling beams and across together onto the cargo net. Richard's family going crazy now as he moves up the cargo net. Oh, slip there. And it looks like Phil taking advantage of that as he gets to the top first. That means he goes across to the further zip line, 90 feet down to the crash mat. Good landing. Time for Phil to beam up as we meet the balance beam. There's Richard just behind him. Phil crosses the balance beam. There's Dad. Come on, Mom says I can hardly bear this. Now he attacks the travelator, and so is Richard. He's caught him up from nowhere. They grab the rope. Do not it's too close to Paul. There'll have to be a video replay. The most dramatic. What a marvellous end to our first show. But let's check the replay. Phil seems to burst through first on the left. Let's check again. And look at that. Yes, Phil comes through first.